in any given day, I'm asked to make hundreds of decisions on budgets, on should we or should we not do something. And if I look back and I, I honestly reflect on what gets me to say yes to a proposal versus what gets me to say no, it usually comes down to the, the logic and the approach of the person presenting the decision and not necessarily the, the outcome of the decision. Uh, a recent phone call demonstrates this point very clearly. Our director of operations gave me a phone call and he said, Jeff, I need to increase the server space that we're using and obviously asking for, for more money. The way he did it was he presented the problem. The problem is that our current situation isn't allowing us the capacity and the needs that, that our business is demanding. The, the cause of this, he illustrated. The effect on the business, he very clearly illustrated. And he gave a well-planned solution. That was to move our server and increase our capacity and do so that we were meeting the demands of the business. And he followed that with the consequence. If we didn't do this, what would happen to the business? what this meant to the business. What he did was he, A, demonstrated very clear logic in his presentation of the decision that needed to be made, and B, he made it easy for me to say yes. There's a five minute phone call. After we finished the phone call, he had what he wanted, which was a clear uh, answer on how to move forward. And I had what I wanted, which was a, a director of operations who had thought about the implications of his decision on the business and made it easy for me to say yes. So remember, when presenting a, a decision that needs to be made to a, a manager or, or, or your boss, remember to make it easy. Follow a, a clear logic and make it easy for your boss to say yes.